So this question, this should say class A here, it got cut off, and this should say class B. The question says, each of the dot plots shown represents the number of glue sticks brought in by each student for two classes, class A and class B. Which statement best compares to standard deviations of the numbers of glue sticks brought in by each student for these two classes? So on this test, standard deviation takes on a very simplistic view that may be more may be more simple than you're than you're used to. It's a very visual standard deviation, right? So you don't typically have to. In fact, I've never seen an example of a digital SAT question where you have to calculate standard deviation. It is very visual. So as long as you understand that the standard deviation has to do with how much the data deviates from the mean, right? So deviation from mean, then you should be able to just kind of visualize here what's happening. So for class A, for instance, I don't know exactly where the mean is, but I would have to imagine it's somewhere in this four to five range. And I can see that, you know, there's a step up for six to seven, and there's a step down for one through three. But when I look at class B, it looks exactly the same, right? Although it's not the same numbers, the mean is there and the deviation to the left is exactly the same as for class A, right? There's three data points, one value down. There's one data point here, one data point here. We see the exact same things here for three, two, and one. And for six and seven, it's an exact replica of what we see for 19 and 20. So visually, the deviation is exactly the same for class A and class B. So I'd expect the correct answer here to say that the standard deviation for class A and for class B must be equal. So let's find that. So choice A says the standard deviation of the number of glue sticks bought in by each student for class A is less than, so I don't like that. Um, choice B says it is equal to like that. So that's what I'm going to go with. And I'm fairly certain that that's the correct answer.